<clears throat> good morning, good afternoon, good evening, YouTubers. This is Jerry Diamond with How to Get Out of Babylon. You know, I, <laughs> I was sitting around with four friends. One was named Jesus. Jesus Elijah Moses. And one was a former brother, Thomas, who later tried to basically kill me. But, uh, I heard he's cleaned up his life a bit, so that's good. He was an, a drunkard. And I've heard that he's no longer a drunkard and may actually be able to enter the kingdom of heaven because drunkards will not be allowed in the kingdom of heaven. But anyway, we were sitting around talking, and um, they said, the lady down the road got a tent. She's living in a tent. And her neighbors think she's crazy. And there was a pause of about, I don't know, maybe one second. And at the same time, all four of us just started laughing. I mean, like, rolling on the floor, laughing our asses off. And we all were saying, she's the only one that's sane. You know, her neighbors are all crazy. Because what she had done was she got out of debt. And she was living in a tent. So, yeah. I wish I would have started there just a few seconds earlier. I was checking the memory to see if I could even make a video. But, um... It was covered with snow, and then all of a sudden the wind came up and whipped those two panels, and it just slid down. So you can see where the clean line is there. And the walls outside will be getting buried with snow. And that's the only panel that did it, that one and a half panels there. Pretty funny. First snow in Missouri from inside a teepee tent. So, hmm. first snow in Missouri from inside a tent of any kind, I think. Actually, I think this is the famous first, first snow in my life <laughs> from inside of a tent. I mean, I haven't been in any raging blizzards. I'm sure I've been in snowstorms. But anyway, this is quite memorable. Cool. Pretty cool. Batteries about dead, memories about shot, need a Google Chrome book, borrow one for a while, I guess, maybe. Anyway, yeah, just pretty cool. Awesome. Love y'all. Be praying for Brother Shannon. He's going to come up here and help and hoping things work out. So, uh, be praying for that whole situation because the, uh, well, I'm not going to go into it, but I need some, you know, prayer on that. Thank you. Bye-bye.